Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel for another grocery haul. Today is Sainsbury's. So I do have a Sainsbury's delivery pass and I had been shopping with them quite a lot. Obviously the last couple of shops have been Morrison's which has been really nice to have a change but there are some bits I wanted from Sainsbury's and obviously since I've paid for a delivery pass I need to make the most of it as well. So um, today's shopping came to £121. Um, there are a few little extras and bits in there um, and I'm waiting for the shopping to arrive actually. It's a few substitutions. So depending whether we're keeping them all or not, it might be a little bit less. So I don't think we've done too bad and um, there is also a meal plan afterwards. So hang on for that and I'm going to show you what we got. Okay, here is nearly everything that I got in this week's shop. I've got a couple of bits on my other side because I couldn't fit them on and I have not put up my water either. So I've got four two litre bottles of water as well. So I don't think I did too bad for a hundred and, uh, what was it? A hundred, it's probably going to be about 116, 117 pounds, I think, once my substitutions have gone off. So anyway, I'm going to start over here. I've got two packets of waffles, just because we like to chop up on those. And um, we often have them for lunches or, um, well, with dinners as well sometimes. I've uh, got some more of the steak cut chips. These are really nice. They do need a bit of salt, but they're actually pretty good. I was quite impressed with those. Not quite the same as Aunt Bessie's, but a really good substitution if you're trying to save money. Then I picked up two of the chicken pots. These are nice. These have gone up a little bit in price, but they're still relatively cheap. Um, they're really nice. Then I decided to get, I'd already put those ones in the basket. Then I noticed these were on offer and um, due to my allergies, there's actually a lot of chicken nuggets I can't have, but I can have these ones. So I picked up two bags of those. I think they're about half price and they're not cheap. So I got some of them. Then picked up some grated cheese, some spinach. So we have um, two packets of smoked ham, two packets of the roasted ham. We've got a gammon steak. I bought a smaller beef mince and now I've got people coming over. So now I wish I'd bought a big one. Um, so when we have sausages, these are the only sausages my son will eat, the pork and apple ones. But I can't have those ones. So I end up buying these ones and then the others will just have a mixture. I bought some of these. I actually, I think, picked these up to go up for the Christmas charcuterie actually rather than our weekly shop. Um, the beef pasty was an offer so I got one of those and also one giant Yorkshire even though there's like two on the packet um, okay before and after right I didn't realise so they're 20% bigger apparently so that's quite good um, so I do like a gravy mince and I put it in the giant Yorkshires for the kids because they like that four pints of milk we've got spinach and ricotta tortellini some scotch eggs these were <laughs> Daisy's just coming covered in snow <laughs> oh bless you so it's snow today today is monday and i think a lot of people have got snow so let us know um if you have snow or not oh. i scotch eggs so i say that yeah probably right over here we've got some romaine lettuce i've got some shreddies some Savoy cabbage, we haven't had that for ages, I thought that would be nice. These are substitutions for the onions, I didn't even see them when they came in, but it doesn't matter, they're fine. Broccoli, cucumber, got some King Edwards, got a load of peppers, I'm not sure why I ordered so many, but I did. Got some bacon potatoes. This was another substitution, I wanted the ones without icing, because um, I know they're dairy free, I need to check these ones. <coughs> I think they have milk in the icing, but I'm not sure. But it is a small amount. It might, yeah, it has got milk in it. Might be all right, we'll see. Then we got some naan breads, some carrots. Um, oh, stuff everywhere. I don't even know where to go. A couple of bags of Smarties, one of the Harry Bows. Viscount biscuits. I used to have these when I was a kid. Absolutely loved them. Kids like those. Topping up on chicken gravy just to make sure we've got enough for Christmas. Outpro vanilla desserts. Got a tin of carrots, sliced ones. 
We've got the apple and mango pouches, two of the rice milks, two of the apple squash. We've got a jar of um, tikka masala. So just to see if the kids like that one. i uh, got some microwave rice. So we have eggs, toilet paper, because my Amazon subscribe and save one has run out. Some fusilli pasta. Some more burnt seeded bread, some washing liquid wraps. So these are not the buns I ordered. Um, in fact, I don't think I ordered hot cross buns. I probably ordered tea cakes. Can't remember. They were a substitution. Some squares, some tortilla chips. Oh, I love these. Whenever they go on offer, I get one. Um, that's my favourite scent. There is another one that I like, a lemon one. It's got some sanitary items, refuge sacks, and my little um, freezer bags. So this is, as you can see, this is actually an awful lot of stuff. And this will be, I think, what's the date? I think this is going to be my last big, big shop before Christmas because I'll be getting my um, Christmas shopping on a different day to, to usual. So that week I will probably get a really small shop or I'll get a small shop at the end of the week before Christmas. I haven't really decided what I'm doing. I just know that there will not be an upload as usual on the Tuesday before Christmas. And if there is, it will be a small shop. Um, but what I will do is I will record my Christmas shopping and I will get it up for you. That is being delivered on the 23rd of December and I will get it up on the 23rd or the 24th for you. So anyway, really pleased with all this. Um, I'm just gonna show you the last few bits that don't fit on the table. All right, so these are the last few bits. I just picked up some different flavors of Pringles. They were on offer. I never buy Pringles unless they're on offer. Um, so I picked up those for my Christmas box. Picked up some after eights. Turns out I'd already bought them, um, but you know, they will get eaten, so I'm not gonna moan. Then I've been trying to get these for the last couple of shops and they haven't had them. So figs in blankets flavour crisps. I'm really looking forward to trying these actually. Um, so yeah, that's for the Christmas box this week. So guys, all of that stuff for, well, under 120, I reckon about 116, 117 pounds, including like the bird's eye chicken nuggets and all that. I think I've done quite well. Um, I will put obviously all the prices up for offer items as I usually do and next I'm going to show you my meal plan here is our meal plan so today is Monday I'm going to do breaded chicken wraps with some salad and some chopped up peppers tomorrow we're going to do the gravy mints uh, with Yorkshire's Wednesday I'm going to do corned beef hash with savoy cabbage Thursday we'll do sausage chips and veg and Friday I'll be chicken curry, rice and naans. So this is our menu for the week. It's just a simple one this week. Um, I have been finding I just have not got the time at the moment or the energy to be doing elaborate dinners as much as I like to. I just haven't been able to. So I'm going to try it and keep it simple. Um, Thursday's one I'll have to cook before I go to college. That'll either be really early dinner for everyone or maybe I'll throw it in the air fryer when I get home. It depends. Um, the corned beef hash is probably going to be the longest one to do. Gravy mints in Yorkshire is quite simple as well. And obviously breaded chicken is easy enough to do. But everybody likes that. So anyway, that is our menu for the week. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. It really does help my channel out, guys. Um, and if you're not already subscribed and you love grocery hauls, then please consider subscribing as well. And you'll be notified of all the ones that I do. Bye, everyone.